Welcome back. My name is Stacey Eberschlag again, and what I've done while we were away is I went ahead and I did, we remember when we, we started, I, I started out with my first frame and my final frame. Then we did our high position. And in our last video, we did our anticipation. And I went ahead and did the remaining keys myself. So I have our push off drawing, our sort of drawing that's going to help define the arc of everything between here and that top position that we did. That remember that. So it's just basically breaking it down so the arms have an arc, the legs have an arc, the body. And then from our top position, leading with the legs, following with the head, following with the arms, and then our stretch position, squash, and then the reverse angle, and then the recover. So I've done all these positions, and I'll just flip through them once or twice. And now they need to have timing and spacing put in. So I know that between here and here, the anticipation, I'm going to need a bit of time. So I'm just going to shift plus. And I always make sure that my frames land on odd numbers. And when I say odd numbers, I'm on 11. You can see that's an odd number. If I were on frame 10, that's an even number. So shift plus, put it on odd numbers. I'm going to spread these out. That's an even number, so I'll spread that out. Okay. I'm just going to spread them out a little bit more. What do we have here? Let's just take a look at that timing without any eases. Okay, I can live with that. Now let's go ahead and put our in-betweens in. And we'll have a little bit of eases. I'm going to ease out a little bit, just a little bit. ease in quite a bit to this one. And there's going to be no eases on that. I'm going to ease up to here. And I'm going to ease out of the top position. And 80 might be too big actually. Let me, see, let me make it a bit smaller. Go back in and make it maybe make it 50. 50. We don't want it to come to a complete stop. And that's something in between. Okay, so I have to do one more breakdown because you notice that it's flipping here. So let's just. Let's just put those beside each other for the time being. Put this there. And settle up. And I'm just going to see what that looks like uh, before I do too much modifications. I'll just make, make this 80. Let's put these all in twos and see what we have. And again, sometimes you have to modify it after the fact. So put this on. 
And what do we have? So we have, oh, that looks okay. So we, now we have a jump. Now, the reason I move these frames around, let's go back in time, is we cannot in between, between facing this way and facing this way. So I basically moved it so there was, it actually came down, hit the ground, and then settled up. So let's put those on twos again. Those on twos by pressing that and hit OK. And now we have a fairly simple jumping action. Thanks for watching.